today. I'm here at the summit. It's an honor to be here and uh, to network with like-minded individuals and to have the support for small businesses here in Texas. I'm looking forward to growth, funding, and other assistance and resources here at the Small Business Summit here at Texas. Bueno, nosotros estamos aquí eh, buscando información de cómo crecer un pequeño negocio para poder generar más empleos, poder generar más ingresos y creo que este es un buen espacio donde estamos adquiriendo información que no siempre es conocida por todos los empresarios. Eh, eso nos va a ayudar a hacer como un upgrade de nuestro negocio y eh, poderlo canalizar eh, para mejoras no solo, de, no solo propias, sino también de la gente que podemos contratar. Would I recommend this summit uh, for next year to anybody? Absolutely. The panelists have been amazing. And if you are looking to start a small business, this is a must to summit to come to, to get the knowledge that you need. The key point is uh, you got to always network, you know, the small business community. By being a veteran, uh, you have to uh, utilize your resources. And that way you can grow your business and, you know, be more profitable. If you missed out on this event, I highly recommend you attend the other ones that are still going around or the one next year. There's a lot of great networking, a lot of great resource partners, um, and then it's an event to attend every year. For anybody that's trying to start a small business out there, one of the biggest pieces of advice I can give is do your research, push forward, and never give up. Because there's going to be hardships in starting your business. If you're one of the lucky few that you don't experience hardships, that's excellent too. But for many people, you know, you face a lot of challenges when you're trying to get your business up off the ground. And it depends on the economy or whatnot. But this is one thing I know, Texas is open for business.